All right, so we got up this morning. The wife wanted chicken fajitas. I wanted stuffed bell peppers. So we compromised. We're going to make chicken fajitas, stuff them in bell peppers, and go from there. First, I'm going to take two bell peppers. I've got an orange one and a green one. We're just going to hone them out, get them clean. And we're going to drop them. I've got some hot water over here already boiling. We're going to soften them up. And then we're going to get started on our chicken. All right, so here's the last one. We're going to get them in here and let them boil for a few minutes, soften up a little bit. Now, let's get started on our chicken. Let me get me a skillet. Where'd my big skillet go? Oh, look at it right here. Let's get started on that. We got our onions and shallots. All right, we got chicken thighs. I got them cut up really small and shredded up. I'm gonna throw a little bit of that cooking with Cajun sauce a bone. Then we're gonna come in here with some of this taco seasoning I'm gonna let this cook down for a little bit get our peppers out of the water we don't want them to really get too too overcooked because they're fixing to go back into a skillet with a lid and some more heat we're gonna let them cool for a couple minutes and then we're gonna get ready to start stuffing them and get them in our big skillet and finish cooking I'm gonna shred some mozzarella. We're gonna shred enough because we're gonna put some in with the meat and the peppers and then we're gonna put some on top. All right, so we're gonna take a little bit of this chicken, put it down in here. Take a little bit of cheese, put it on there, and take a little bit more chicken. And then a little bit more cheese. And we gonna set that in our skillet. 
stand up right now like I want you to do. Then we're going to repeat the process. So meat. Little cheese. More meat. More chicken. Uh, we're just going to continue this till we get them all done. Inside's clean. Just what happens to the outside when you put a bunch of cold on them all the time. guys so they've been cooking for about 15 minutes and that's it they are done we're gonna pull them off and we're gonna have them with some tortillas and mexican rice and refried beans 